what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? A clip from the sixth season of the second episode of the CBS show, The Good Fight, has gone viral. In that clip, actor Delroy Lindo gives it back to a couple of guys who really, 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 I mean really want to use the N-word. The episode was titled Day 443. Delroy is a guest panelist at a news channel. They are having a discussion about racism. The topic is titled, Is Racism a Two-Way Street? So, Delroy patiently listens to these guys talk about the use of the N-word and how racism, how white people experience racism also, and how it is hypocritical for black people to use the word and they can't use it. And so he's just sitting there patiently trying not to be the angry black guy. And the guys are like, well, you know, these African Americans, uh, rappers are using the word and Caucasians can't, you know? So finally, Darrow is like, Okay, well, use it. Dude's like, what do you mean? Say, use it. Use the word. Say the word. Oh, I'm not saying I want to say the word. I'm just saying I can't. He said, no, no, no. You want to say it? Say it. Say it. I'll help you. N you know, he gave him the first syllable. N <laughs> it's only a TV show, but it's funny as hell because it's very realistic. It was so realistic that at first I thought it was <laughs> real because I had never saw the show before. I'd never seen the show before, so I thought it was real. But, you know, I did my research. I was like, okay, this looks like it could be polished, a little too polished. So I looked it up and sure enough, it's from a TV series. But it's very real because I've heard a number of white people complain about not being able to use the word, at least without consequences or in polite company, right? Just recently, I talked about how, what's that guy, the Tiger King, Joe Exotic, what, went on a rant a few years ago, talking about he can't use the N word, which by the way, I do not see what black people see in watching that show. Actually, I don't really see what any decent person see in watching the show. I don't like tigers that much. You dig what I'm saying? To pad the pockets of somebody like him. But moving on. There are some white people out there who really wants to use that word publicly. And I say publicly because you know if they want to use it that bad, they use it already. You dig what I'm saying? But they want to be able to use it publicly. They want to be able to use it publicly without consequences. And I don't think that we're ever going to reach that moment in history. I just don't see it. I know that there are some white people who have black friends and they get to say it around their black friends. But one of these days, they're going to say it around somebody else. They're going to be out of pocket and they're probably going to get the noodles knocked because it's just one of those words. It's the type of word that just has it's a trigger word. It's one of the greatest trigger words of all time. I don't see that changing. And I personally believe that if it means that much to you to say it, just say it. Because that's what I do. 
if I feel like doing something as much as some of these people really want to say the N-word publicly, I do it. I just said in a fight come with, I'd be the, the one white person walking around just saying the word and I don't care if I get attacked. I'd be ready to fight back, whatever. You know, I just say it. That's real conviction. That's how I'm built. But I'm not in the business of going around offending people. So I don't care to use any word that much. If a group of people say we don't like that word, that's a bad term, that's a derogatory term against us, then even if I use it, maybe I, I, I didn't know. But once they educate me, then I'll just leave it alone. I don't care to offend people that much. But some of these people, man, they really, really enjoy the use of that word. It's, it's like spinach. It's like spinach to Popeye, you know? It's really like, it fuels them. It's like oxygen for some people. It, it's empowering. Why? Why is it so important? For white people in America specifically, the inability to use the N-word without consequences should give them some insight on what it must be like for black people every day in America to walk around and not be able to do the things that they see others do and get away with it. No more talk. What the talking about?